Hello, this is Horse Quest Online with our first tutorial video. In this video, I'll be showing you the basics of gameplay and teaching you how to use different features. So here we are at the main menu. Before entering the game world, you'll be given an option to play either online or offline. Playing online means you'll be able to see other players and interact with them. To play in this mode, you'll need an internet connection. However, if you choose to play offline, an internet connection is not required as you'll play just by yourself. Before you play online, you'll be given the option to either join a room or create your own. To join a room, simply tap any of the available rooms shown in the list. If you want to create a room for other people to join, select the Create Room option at the bottom. You can change the room name if you wish. Now that you've entered the game world, let's learn the basics of controlling your character. On the left hand side of your screen, you'll see a circular control dial. Dragging this outwards makes your horse move forward in the direction you want it to go. Want to go faster? Well, you can choose between three gates, walk, trot, and gallop. You can change your speed with the up and down arrows on the right hand side of your screen. Also, you can easily change the scale of the map by zooming in or out with the magnifying glasses in the bottom left hand corner. To progress further in the game, you'll need to level up by completing quests. To get started, head over to the quest center, a circle of tall glowing stones located at the far left side of the map. Simply walk into the quest area to receive your first mission. Once you've completed your task, you can head back to the quest center to receive your next quest. The more quests you do, the more you'll level up. As a wild horse, you're bound to get hungry. Between doing quests and exploring, you'll need to find some food to eat to keep your energy levels up. If you don't, you won't be able to run as fast. Find a food source, such as hay or mushrooms, and click the eat button for your horse to graze. The bar with the carrot at the top will show you how much energy you have remaining. If you're playing in online mode, then you'll be able to add friends. Locate the make friends icon on the left hand side of your screen. In this window, you'll be able to see the players that are currently online, your friends that are online, and also pending friend requests. To send a friend request, click the plus sign next to a player's name in the online column. If they accept your request, they will now appear under Friends Online. If someone sends you a friend request, their name will appear in the third column under Requests. To accept, simply press the tick. If you want to remove a friend, click the red box beside their name. Chatting is another feature available to everyone playing in online mode. To chat, simply enter your message into the bar shown at the bottom right hand corner of your screen and send it with the yellow arrow. If you look directly under the chat bar, you will see the option everyone. If you have this selected, your message will be visible to all online players in your current room. However, you can also send a private message to a friend if you scroll along the list and select their name. That's all for now, so thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more exciting updates on HorseQuest Online, or check us out on social media. Bye for now!